Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. Today, I will explain about the optical communication method used in satellite communication within three minutes. Okay, let's find that together. There are three main methods of optical communication. The first one is on off key. Uh, this is the simplest method. This communication method sends data by changing the state of laser, uh, which is turned on and off. Okay, so this method is called on off key. For example, when the laser is emitted, it means one. And when the laser is not emitted, it means zero. Almost of all remote controls, such as TV remote controls, transmit data in this method. This method is also used in the satellite communication method. Uh, OSETS is the world's first satellite, which demonstrated inter-satellite optical communication between GEO to RIO, and used this, uh, uses this communication method. Even today, this method is widely used in optical communication in space. The second one is coherent method. This method uses the wave nature of radar. Data is sent by deforming the waves of light, such as phase, amplitude, and frequency of the laser. For example, in this case of PSK, uh, data is sent by changing the phase of wave. For example, uh, when the data when the data changes from zero to one, the phase changes 180 degrees. Vice versa, when the when the data are changing uh, from one to zero, the phase changes as before. The data is sent like this way. This method is suitable for high speed and high sensitivity communication. So it is often used for the optical fibers communication on the ground. It is often used for inter-satellite laser communication, but since it is necessary to control the phase of laser accurately, so the equipment often becomes larger. The third one is PPM method. This is similar to on-off key, but a little different. This method uses pulse laser and send data by changing the timing of the pulse. For example, in this case of method called 2PPM, uh, the timing of light uh, is two-way. Zero and one are sent depending on the timing of the light. For example, in this figure, uh, look at each uh, bit slot. Uh, if a pulse uh, is located in, uh, in the first half of the slot, it means zero. And if a pulse is located in the second half of the slot, uh, it means one. So, right this way, uh, PPM can transmit data. Okay, what good point of this method? Uh, this is uh, this method can transmit a stronger laser momentary because the laser can transmit in a pulse shape. So uh, this this strong laser uh, this strong laser is important for long distance communication where light is emitted. All sets also demonstrated the PPM method from real to geo communication, and NASA is also planning to use this PPM method. For Mars satellite, because uh, this satellite communicate with the Earth by the optical communication. Thank you for watching today. Uh, don't forget like this video and subscribe to my channel. Okay, see you later.